Okay, hi everyone, Mad Monkey Forever here, and today I'm going to be unboxing my brand new iPod Nano. Ooh. This is the fifth generation one, I think it was released this sometime this year, and it's very nice pink, wafer thin too, and it's 8 gigabytes. Yes, 8. 2,000 songs, which is a great update to my um, iPod Nano third generation. Stores about 1,000, I think, on 4 gigabyte. Um, got this yesterday at HMV, as you can see, that's the number there, for technical support, um, for about £115, so uh, it's not so bad, I suppose, a lot cheaper than the iPod Touch. This comes in lots of nice colours, and I thought I'd go for pink, because it's nice and girly. So I'm going to open it up now. I've already pulled the sticker part off it, so that really helps. Save some time, there we go. Okay. Just pull this off. There we go. It's the iPod itself. Just push the webcam slightly. There we go. It's the iPod itself, which we're going to push out in a minute. I do apologise, my webcam is pulling up slightly. Um, what else have we got in here? Um. <coughs> okay, let's push that out of the way. We have the start here guide which is I think it's in Greek or Russian and some of the language which I'm not sure about and it's just a quick start basically it's in Polish and other languages as well um, we have important product information um, some sort of iPod stickers I'm not sure what they do but I think you stick them on the iPod okay um, Some sort of iPod docking thingy. Um, got nice iPod headphones. Just get those out of the way. Yeah, we've got nice iPod headphones here. And we have the USB cable. But you can buy the plug separately for about another fiver for HMV or whatever shop you get them from. Now let's have a look at the iPod itself. Just pop it out of its thing. <coughs> ah, there we go. It's never easy to get them out. And as you can see, it's a very nice shiny pink. Very metallic. Wafer thin, as you can see. And as you can see, the lock button is now at the top, rather at the bottom, unlike the third generation iPod Nano. That's for the headphones. And that's the USB thing, so... Gotta switch it on, see if it's activated. Ah, there we go. Just the Apple logo. Choose your language, which is English UK. And there we go, we're activated. Obviously, this needs charging, but I'll deal with that later. And I need to add my song to my old iPod, so I'm gonna do that in a bit. One new thing you got a radio. And you got a video camera, which doesn't take normal pictures, it's just a video camera. Video camera is here at the side, just here. Well, I think the quality's pretty good for a, a video camera. It's not bad quality. And you can see myself in it. Yeah, so it's not bad quality, kind of thing. And we have games on it too, which is which is here somewhere. Ah, another good thing, it's got a pedometer, which actually tells you how many steps you've taken in the day. So, yeah, that's pretty handy. And you've got. Klondike, which is like a card game. Maze, which is a maze, obviously. Vortex, which was shown in the other iPod Nano, which I've got. We've even got voice memos, which I think is pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's actually picking up my voice right now. Yeah. It's got all the other stuff contacts, clocks, that sort of stuff. 
uh, what I like about it, it's got a bigger screen, which is a lot better than the iPod Nano 3rd generation. You can even turn it over when you're playing songs. You can have videos, photos, music. So basically you can just shake it to shuffle. Well, oh, I think that's pretty cool. And I'm going to go put some songs on it in a minute. So, go swish it off. Go push it to play. Then push it to lock button. There we go. Hey. <coughs> There we go. Alright, so I'm going to do a proper review of this once I've uploaded songs and videos and whatnot. I'll show you what it basically does, so bye. <laughs>